Hi, my name is Demetrius, and I have over 21 years of acting experience from the silver screen to the big screen. Welcome to my YouTube channel, where I'm going to take you along my journey of all things acting, Q&As, shorts, the acting lifestyle, and much more. On the fence about acting or just want to see some fun gorilla shorts? You've come to the right place. I'm going to give you the full story from every perspective. Stay around for a while. I promise you won't regret it. All of the things I didn't say, and all of the things I did, but didn't want to. With every passing second and every passing day, I found myself thinking of you. More and more, I yearned to feel you in my arms again. My lips on your lips, my eyes on yours, and our hearts together in unity. In such an instant, you made me feel alive again. My heart started to beat at a temple I'd all but forgotten was possible. All of the things I didn't say haunted me. I replayed our conversations like my favorite part in a movie, except I'm on draft 12 and I can't seem to rewrite it. The result is always the same. Me here with my thoughts, and you out there in the world. I berated myself with all the choices I made as I tried to reanalyze a new path where we magically find the perfect scenario and we live happily ever after. All the while knowing that no matter how the story played out, I was going to be left with a broken heart. You see, the thing I didn't understand was while I was so busy loving you, I forgot to love myself. Everything was about you. What you wanted, how you felt, how the things I said were impacting you. I never once asked myself those same questions. My needs were secondary and we both prioritized the same person. Instead of meeting me halfway, I gave you all of me, naively thinking you'd do the same. All of the things I didn't say are starting to fade. The more I understand myself, the more your face starts to blur. The more my thoughts are centered on my goals and ambitions, the less I hear your voice. As I work on myself and nurture the neglected parts of my soul, I find unhealthy thoughts and feelings purging themselves from my system. With every passing second and every passing day, I find myself thinking of me and the ways I can love myself. I believe you're an omen to remind me the consequences of being too selfless with my love. All the sadness is now burning in me like a coal engine propelling me forward. I don't believe you can truly love someone if you don't love yourself. And I'm learning to do that. One day at a time.